Okay, so we are at our favorite place, Pepito's. Um, if you guys are in the Fort Walton area, Dustin area, you guys have to come here. It is one of our favorite Mexican restaurants. We cannot stay away from this place. I normally get Thank you, the... I get the loaded grilled chicken quesadilla. It is so freaking good. And then Steven always gets like a bunch of different things. The carne asada is my favorite though. That one is your favorite? Yeah, oh my gosh, I cannot wait. This is going to be so good. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys. So we just got out of Hobby Lobby and if you couldn't tell, there is a big giant desk back there and I am so excited about it. On our way out of Hobby Lobby, you know, like when you enter a Hobby Lobby, they've got like all the furniture and stuff like that set up in that like the entrance room before you actually enter the store. Um, so we were walking out and as we were walking out, I was looking at all of the furniture and spotted this beautiful desk that's behind me and I could not leave without it. I, it's literally beautiful. It's exactly what I wanted they had it set up so nice obviously setting the mood to like entice you to want to buy it more and boy was I a sucker because I fell for it um they had it set up with like a desk and then like a nice calendar over the top and then like a beautiful pink like rolly office chair it was just beautiful I checked the price and it was originally 250 with 30 percent off you know all like Hobby Lobby all their furniture is always 30% off um, and so it came down to 175 and I just thought that was such a great deal Steven really enjoyed the desk too I've actually been like looking for a desk for a while and every time I find one Steven doesn't really like them um, but oh, this one I like this one yeah, this one he liked, and so if he liked it, I was like, I have to hop on this right now. So we got it, and it is absolutely beautiful. It's kind of like farmhouse, more industrial, or like industrial farmhouse style. I think it's amazing. I cannot wait to get it in the office and like decorate it with everything I want, so that'll definitely be a video that's coming. Maybe? I'm not really sure if I'll like fully decorate the office. Um, like I may buy like it probably won't even be worth it, honestly, because we're not going to make That's what I was thinking. Like, maybe I'll buy, like, a few knickknacks here and there, um, because there's definitely not a TJ Maxx or a Hobby Lobby in Italy. So, <laughs> if I do find things that I would like in my office, then maybe I'll buy a couple. But I'm definitely not going to go all out and decorate the room for, like, what, four weeks? And then have to take it all back down for the movers. So, um... Yeah, I'm just, I'm really excited. So now we are actually on our way. We're out in Dustin and we are on our way to go get one last birthday gift for Steven. So in his birthday vlog or in his birthday video, um, a few vlogs ago, I had mentioned that there was one more item that I was needing to get him, but the place was closed when I tried to. So it's open. So we're going to go and just do it together. He kind of figured out what the gift was. Um, so we're going to go do it. I'm actually getting him a float spa package is that what you would call it I don't even know what's going on I don't know if you guys have heard about that but it's basically like a float spa so like you get into this little pod looking thing and you just float he's been really wanting to do that for a little bit and so I think that would just be like a really cool present for him so we're gonna go get that and we're gonna try and find an office chair because your girl can't use the desk without an office chair am I right I was thinking just a foldable chair Boy. A foldable lawn chair. Put it right there. You're good to go. <laughs> if you don't quit. I'll get you one with a cup holder. You can drink coffee. <laughs> one of my, my Dallas Cowboys foldable <laughs> chair from the garage. <laughs> um, so we're going to do that. And then later on when we get back to the house, we're going to take Dallas to the dog park. And obviously now I have to set up my desk. And what else? I think that's it. I might do a little bit of cleaning, I'm not really sure. But yeah, those are the major things that are going on right now. Um, I will catch up with you guys a little bit later. Okay, so here's what I was talking about, like the float spa gift for Steven. We just left there and Steven booked his appointment. He's really excited for it. He's never floated before, neither have I. But if you guys have heard of this, let me know down in the comments below. For at least me and Steven, this is a new concept that we've never really heard of before. Um, so he's really excited to try it. And then based off of if he likes it, then I might try it as well. But it's really good for like muscle relaxation. And Steven has a lot of issues with 
with like back pain and elbow pain and everything else. <laughs> so he's really excited to try that. Um, and I'll like definitely keep you guys updated to let you know how he liked it. All right, you guys, we're off to hopefully find an office chair, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> So, so far I haven't been able to find an office chair. So I'm over here looking at kind of like the office aisle, just seeing if there's anything else that I want. I've already got a desk calendar that I've showed you guys like in many, many vlogs ago. So I'm just kind of going through it and seeing if there's anything that I want. I think a clock would be cute, but it's not necessary because obviously my computer has a clock. Um, I am thinking about like a lamp or something similar to that. I think that would look good on there. I don't know, or maybe I might try and decorate it with some decor that I already have at the house. I mean, you guys know I have a bunch just sitting around. But yeah, I'm kind of disappointed. I did not see any office chairs. You guys, look at this beautiful, beautiful chair. Oh my gosh, this matches my aesthetic perfectly. But the price is 150 and I'm just not, like I'm not paying that. That is outrageous. I mean, the chair is cute, but it doesn't even have arms. Like, no thanks. I'm not paying that for that. Like, I want it done, but I'm not that desperate. Like, I can wait for a chair. Oh, I'm so pissed. Maybe Amazon will have something similar for cheaper. But they have some really cute office stuff in here. Like Steven said, he liked that lamp. And I said, yeah, it's cute if they have it in black. And then I found it in black over there. So I might get that lamp. It's really cute. Those chairs, like, I just, I don't like that style. Dang it. How are these chairs cheaper, but they're bigger than the office chair that I just showed you guys? These chairs are only 130, but they're way bigger. Like, I don't get it. Just because that other chair can roll, it's like $20 more. It was smaller than these. That's crazy. We're done at Marshalls and Home Goods. Um, I hope that you guys could hear me in those like previous clips, but I am really, really sad that I did not get that desk chair. I mean, it was freaking beautiful, but there's just no way I could justify paying $150 for that chair. Not to me, she couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I just like, I couldn't. Like that was, that was almost the entire price of the desk. Like that's just outrageous but it was a beautiful chair so we're actually gonna make one more stop and we're gonna stop at Ross and see if maybe I can find a chair in there that I like as well um, and then after that we're heading home and we're taking Bubba's to the dog park we're really excited because this PCS you guys has been so crazy to say the least and we've kind of not that like we've been neglecting dallas but we are so busy like jam-packed morning to night with things to do with this pcs that we at least make sure to walk him in the evenings but he hasn't been to the dog park in what maybe like a, a week. week yeah and we typically take him to the dog park like what two three times a week I think our problem is like we spoil him all the time taking him all these places and stuff and since we haven't been doing that as much we feel bad even yeah. though he still gets out more than those dogs yeah that's, that's the is. thing we're used to like doing so much with him that with this PCS stuff we have kind of like we're not able to do as much with him so it's really starting to like weigh on our hearts and like, we feel like exactly terrible it. dog parents um so after we're done at ross we're gonna make sure that we take him to his favorite place the dog park give him a puppuccino afterwards and then not a puppuccino pup cup. a pup cup <laughs> and um just give him lots of lemons like later and then he'll be so tired so then we can set up my office <laughs> and I'm so excited for this vlog that you guys are seeing. It was edited in my new office on my new desk. Well, I'm playing games. <laughs> yeah. So I'm really excited. But yeah, I just thought I would check in with you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are on that office chair. I really, really liked it. If it was cheaper, I would have gotten it. But I could not justify paying that. That's like almost buying like another desk or buying a rug or buying a bunch of decor items. Like I couldn't justify that, but hopefully I'll get lucky in Ross and I do have a gift card that I have yet to use for Ross. So we'll see what happens. Bubba's, where are we going? He doesn't know yet. Do you want to know where we're going? Um, We're going to go to the dog park. You want to go to the dog park? Do you want to go to the dog park? Do you want to go to 
the dog park mm -hmm. and see your friends. <laughs> yes? Bubba, do you want to go to the dog park? Do you want to go? Okay, let's go! <laughs> You're so cute. All right, guys. So we are back home now. We just got back home. Dallas had a blast at the dog park, and he just ate. Mama's is eating right now, but our house is kind of a mess. There is stuff everywhere. But I wanted to show you guys what we got from Marshalls. We just got three items, I guess, if you count this like big, giant, reusable bag. We're starting to buy these because we don't use them now. I guess we should, but we don't. Um, so this is our first one, but over in Europe and in Italy where we're going to be, um, they like shopping off base, like shopping locally in the towns. Um, these are the type of bags that they use. They use all reusable bags and we don't have any. So we're starting to stock up on them right now. This is a giant one and it was only 90 cents. It was only 99 cents from Marshalls. So from Marshalls, we got that bag. I think it was really cute. And I'm trying to get like not all feminine ones because I know Steven sometimes will be doing the grocery shopping. I'm going to prop you guys up here really quick so I can show you everything that I got. All right. So Steven um, has been having like a lot of like muscle pain, like bone pain. I don't know, whatever you want to call it, right? Back pain. Back pain, muscle pain, arms. aches, arms, everything. Um, and his doctor told him to look into getting like a compression sleeve. So he got this one. I guess it's the brand Copper. No, Cooper. Is that Copper or Cooper? Let me see. That's Copper. Is it? Yeah. I guess. Okay. Cooper has two O's. Cooper? You just said this was Cooper. No, I said that's Copper. Oh, okay. Everyone, you'll hear me say it. <laughs> He got this brand, uh, Copperware. It's just like an arm sleeve for his elbow. And then I got this industrial style lamp and I'm really excited for it. Honestly, looking at it right now on the camera, it kind of looks like the one from Pixar that like bounces and then crushes the eye and like turns like that. So I got this one. I thought it was really cute, just the industrial touches. It also has a USB port so I can charge my phone or my computer or anything. So I'm excited. We did bring the desk upstairs. So I will go show you guys yeah. that right now, what that room is looking like and where my office is gonna be for like four weeks. <laughs> um, and I just sometimes, like today when I posted that I was getting my office desk, I did get a message from you guys and someone asked me why I was still buying furniture even though we're going to be moving. And that's because anything that I take, like anything that we have now, we're just going to move it with us. And in Italy, like there is no Hobby Lobby, TJ Maxx, you know, Marshalls, Home Goods, Target, like there is nothing like that. And I know even the Amazon that services Italy is kind of like wonky on their um, inventory too. So anything that we can grab right now, we're taking with us because obviously it's going to go into our next house. Um, and just the style in Italy is not like it is here in America. So we're trying to get as many like items as we want for our house now that like we'll still use then. But that's why we are still buying things. Um, now let's go look at the desk. <laughs>
and end this video here. We have had a mega busy day today and we didn't even plan on having a busy day. It would just kind of, I don't know, snowballed into one accidentally. Steven is giving Dallas a bath currently, so I'm going to go help out and end this video here. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.